Welcome, you guys. We are back. Northwest Burgers is back. Dun, da, da, da. Hey, everyone. Hey, wait. Let me see those masks. Oh, yeah, those, those are masks. fashionable burger masks. Oh, my God. Where'd you get those? We had an incredible customer that actually contacts who's not just a customer, but a good friend of ours. And he asked how many employees we're having back. And he had them all, made them right before we opened, came in on Monday and dropped them off to us. It was so really cool. So how long cool. has it been since you guys have been gone? Six weeks. So this is a big... Yeah. And how was this, like, how did you afford to do this? Um, I did, I got into debt. <laughs> that's, I mean, just to be honest, that's, that's what happens. You know, we had uh, a lot of personal stuff deferred and everything else. Um, but, you know, in the long run, you're going to have to pay that back anyway. Um... So but still, back now, and it's just a pickup only. we felt it was ready. Um, Felicia and I felt safe to open and start serving the, um, the community. We didn't in the beginning. We felt like it was a good time for us to close. It was a good time for our employees to go get unemployment before, you know, the huge wave that kind of came through. Um, there was many reasons why we did it. Um, I think it was the smartest decision. And now we're just hoping that we can stir serve a lot of burgers and open inside at one point so you guys they one of the things they did is they have a new website and beefed it up so it's very order friendly um, and everything obviously is takeout and you go on the website you place your order it's really simple where it says order now just click there and that's where you order or you can also come in uh, there's I'll show you in a second kind of how they set it up so everybody's really safe um, everybody's got their rubber gloves on I had to stall on that just for a second. <laughs> and you guys, just so you know, nothing here is frozen. That, nope. It's against the rules, except oh, for the I, French fries. I would love to say one thing to you. One, um, hold on, hold on. Let me get this on because when you talk with that little muffle on, I got to get really close here. <laughs> so one thing I wanted to say real quick is that today on our website, we have something called the Family Special. If you order that, we are randomly putting in... $50 gift cards in those bags. So not in every bag, but in some. Not every bag. But we want to make sure they're going to families and stuff like that. That's really cool. Yeah. So what what, what have you learned from this whole thing, Garrett? Gosh, um, don't sweat the little things. That's it. That's really where it, where it comes down to for me. Um, you know, it's all about safety of family, safety of friends and stuff like that. And uh, money and everything else like that. Of course, we need to survive, but that's not what's not, that's not important. So what's the significance of coming back? Even though your hours are, you know, they're reduced to 11 to 3, 1130 to 3, and uh, there's different hours for different days, but most of, that's pretty close for most of it. Yeah. But, but what did, why come back? Um, why come back and like start? It feel good. I mean, it's just like, okay, got to get started. Oh, yeah. I gained like 10 pounds. I'm ready to work, Rick. <laughs> I really am, you know. Just like I've said many times, I had so much fun with my family and everything else like that. But it was time for us to get back into the kitchen. And then I get to see my best friend, Brett. So. Yeah, Brett is our, we love this man. So, and, and here's how it works now. So you can kind of see, are you still making shakes? I am. You are? Okay, I'll be there in a second. So everything's to go. In the boxes. Same fresh food. Always fresh, never frozen patties locally sourced and you guys they're getting orders from lots of construction folks in here and then here look at this we've got the milkshake lady <laughs> hey how does this feel to be back oh i'm so happy to be here so happy to be able to support my job and other local businesses around town for sure you just opened this morning but you already had quite a few people yeah we've had uh i mean people calling people ordering online people doing Grubhub I honestly I think this is gonna be a really successful like turnaround and they see everybody I've seen at the window standing there they look like really happy to you yeah. know what I mean? super happy and like just like ready to be here I think yeah all right do your thing thank you so much oh you're welcome <laughs> you guys they make some of the most amazing shakes ever and are you selling the alcohol? You can't sell the alcohol ones, can you? I don't think so. Yeah. When, when they reopen for real, like when they're here all the time, they put they make some really outlandish um, locally sourced alcohol milkshakes. So let me kind of show you in here, too, for a second. Oh, go ahead, Brett. I'll follow you. Here's kind of the process. Comes in here. Order up. 
and you can see people are already here. So let me kind of show you. So there's nothing in here, but look at people are already coming to the window. And then what happens is there's a window like right here and they got a plastic. I'm going to show you. Hey man, you're live just so you know. So they're back. So see you guys see there's a plastic w wall here so that he's completely protected. We, we have a, oh, well, look at you. You didn't know, huh? You had no idea. So tell me, um, why are you here? Hold on. Support our local businesses. Of course. Absolutely. Support, yeah. Yeah, absolutely. Yep. And to get some delicious food. I love my large jack. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's a regular. <laughs> All right, I'll get out of here so they can take care of you. So that's how it works, you guys. You just come up to the window, or they also have a door here for orders that are for family orders. And again, as Garrett told us, they're going to be putting some random $50 gift cards for families in there in some of the boxes. Hello, Felicia. Hi, I'm keeping my social distance and letting you come out from behind the bar, but I'm going to go help these okay, kind you customers. Go. You go do your thing. How's it going, everybody? Yeah, I love yeah? it. Look at their our friends made them for us we're so thankful they made them for our entire staff so they made their friends made these masks for their entire staff here and uh, so that's how it works you just come up to the counter and uh, you can pick up your order there uh, it's best to order them online uh, that's again they've just had their website completely redone so you can order online and then you just come out here and as you can see um, this is a popular place <laughs> and they're taking a risk you know by doing this and coming in and uh, and opening up but part of it is they're ready uh, they think that people are ready and their hours again are reduced it's 11:30 to 3 and then um, for most of the week and let me show you one of the services you can order through is I'll show you really fast this is a new service in town it's my menu helper a local company and it's a lot less expensive and they will also you can order through them and they will deliver it to you so again uh, we are at Northwest Burger we're reopening today uh, to take out orders only after being shut down for six months or six weeks excuse me and obviously there is a want here because there's people lining up outside socially physically I say distancing and again, um, so give them a call, support your local businesses. We will be pushing them every chance we get. I'm going to go back one more time into the kitchen. All right, guys, thank you. Hey, thank you. So keep up. You got a line out there. Oh, good. It's physically distanced, but it's a line. Good. That's what we love to hear. Thank you guys for showing the support to us. We appreciate it a lot. Big day, huh? Big day. Is it more, more, more than just like, we're doing business and that kind of stuff, but it's some sense of being back or you're, yeah. it's, it's kind of like we were talking last night. Um, COVID-19, we'll win. you don't win. Exactly, exactly, we're gonna win. Thanks buddy. Hey, love you, love you, you Brett. See you guys later. Oh, look at those cute little burgers. Oh. Those are like little baby burgers. <laughs> All right, you guys, Northwest Burger, support Thank local. You. And tomorrow we'll be at Blue Valley Bistro. Our friends in Coburg are going to be reopening on Friday. So we'll be doing that. I'm Rick Dancer. This is Get Real with Rick Dancer. We'll talk with you guys later.